Hello and welcome back to Snowman on our hard mode series. You join me almost picking up exactly where we left off. Um, I have jumped to the White Western Star because we're going to need to go and rescue our fleet star. If you missed the last one, go back and check it out. We rolled again. It was um, oh, mighty frustrating to say the least. As, as all rolls are, but that one was the, the we are there. Just stupid. Just me being stupid. Now I am even wondering whether I should be going with the Land Rover. The Land Rover would probably pull that over and have a little bit more maneuverability. I'm not sure. We're gonna go. We're gonna go with the uh, the White West. And what we like for you will have to grab. This this is the the big annoying part is that we're gonna be wasting fuel. Wasting fuel all the time. So, so, so frustrating. But anyway, thanks for joining us again and uh, appreciate the spot in the series. I do apologise if there has been a, a bit of a break again. Um, getting time to record no, and being able to edit and upload has just been really, really difficult lately. Hopefully we'll, we'll get back on track at some point. I will get this out as soon as I can. Hoping today, as this is often the case again, hoping today I'll be able to get a few of them recorded, so let's see how that goes. Right, let's grab some fuel. Let's make sure we get this right, because I always get it wrong. The fuel tank is nearly empty. Sure, I'm going to grab the fuel. Well, we've got a fuel trailer uh, sort of halfway up. <laughs> the mountain. Although I think that does mean we then don't take the shortcut. So perhaps that needs relocating as well. Oh! See, I just don't got my head on. We could have put our trailer on and done these little plumbing competition timed jobbies. Just not pop another wheel. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. Let's, uh, let's just get the... Get the get a free start that and <laughs> worry about things after that. It's just uh, yeah. Coming back in and sort of seeing the fleet start rolled over <laughs> it's they put me in a bad mood, not that tell. It's so frustrating. And it's like I say it's frustrating just to, because of the way I did it. I didn't need to try and take a shortcut. And then when I took the wrong angle, I knew it was wrong. I knew it was. And um, yeah I didn't do enough to stop it. Silly boy. Yeah, so instead of taking that shortcut, we'll go, oh, I'm going to lose another tyre, I know I am. He seems so sensitive at the minute. I swear like, we, we hoss around here sometimes with no, no issues at all. And then lately, Every stone, every bump causes us grief. I think there is a decent amount of fuel in here. Not really, no. Okay. Thought there was more. I'm also wondering whether to work. Uh, that editing and cutting these down a little bit. Like I like the whole hour thing, but at the minute I, I just keep driving back and forth along the same roads, not pulling anything because I'm, I'm pausing up. Whether I should just start cutting that out, especially if nothing happens along the way. 
I don't know, you guys let me know. You guys let me know. Going forwards, shall we shall we cut out empty trips? Shall I edit that out and just get to the action a bit more or let me know. Take this one now. Here on, girl, this shouldn't be a struggle for you. Try to save fuel now where we can. But again, that makes it a little bit of a slower trip. Which puts me in the mind of maybe we should uh, should trim some of that journey, the journey in out, especially the, the empty load journeys. I can say if I do something stupid, obviously we'll have it and keep it in. Landy's there if we need it. If, if that looks like that might be a better option, we'll have to pull that through as well. And we'll have everything back in Drummond that we spent three, three or four episodes bringing out. It's just stupid. Alright, let's go try and get the fleet down. Drummond Island, Michigan, USA. We don't need that, let's just get going. Oh, crumble the rock. Man, it's abused. It is so, so, so abused. And uh, apologies if there's any sort of weird background noises and stuff today, or in any of the sort of next few episodes. We'll try to do some recording during half term, so anything going on in the background not just in my house but outside as well get every little bloody rock every rock long before the sticks start giving me grief. <laughs> I'm just going 
just going to take a little out of there as well. I was going to say that better not be empty because I was on the wrong trailer. Yeah, the only sort of thing that I'm concerned about. Hmm. Am I trying to take the <laughs> oh dear. take the route through the trees that I wanted to come through? Because I don't know how else I want to get beside the truck to try and write it. If that makes sense. Do what I do want to do? Not that. I want to. Stop track the job. Did not come out the right. I didn't come out the right way. Look. That way. Other side. Other side. Those trees. Is that right? That is right. Well, oh, we're not close enough. So then in turn, I now want to I'll start the engine for starters. One of them. Good lordy. I can I just reverse? I'd love to get them both up there, to be fair. This is why some things should only be done in normal mode and never in hard mode, because they go wrong. Oh dear, do I try it again? What would I feel? Oh, I'll tell you what, stop pissing about us, just, just, just get out of here. <laughs> we have cement to go and collect. 
we have more fuel to burn in a sense with that as well. I was going to try and incorporate it with the um, super order, but I think I might just, just do the cement on its own. See where it needs to go, who has what. I think we'll do one of the um, time deliveries on the way back as well. I think the fleet star will be fine with it. I've done it once again. I've done it before with the fleet star, so no doubt it'll uh, it'll, it'll go to itself. <laughs> Never mind. At least we're still laughing, or at least I'm still laughing with it. It's when I start to cry and shout. I get frustrated with the game. But I love the game, so it's all right. together hopefully. Let's see if we can top the fleet star up as well while we're here. It'd be cool if it's oh, cameras. It'd be cool if it, you know, stuck a person model in there. And you had them driving as well. Yeah, there's two two cargoes to deliver to the the house down in what I keep calling the swamp, and that's from the warehouse just the other side of this uh, this tunnel. And then when we do the delivery to the house that's being built up here, I think there's some nest or something it's called. We can then do a second run back down to the swamp because we'll have a trailer up that way. We'll not waste too much time with that. Come you along. It just stops. <laughs> just in case I mess up and I need to go recover myself again. There is every chance to call his vehicles now. I just need to double check what the cargo is that I want. 
as we'll load up first, naturally. So, uh, going under, that's the one. Uh, concrete blocks is what we need. If you remember, we tried to do the, the one coming up this way, and the crane didn't work on the uh, the White Western style, which is a bit weird. Good today, so we'll have it. If you do enjoy a bit of snow runner, and uh, I hope that you do, <laughs> that's why you're here. Uh, the the chat that I enjoy watching, uh, Wessel's finally on the latest expansion on his uh, long running series, so he'll have had them all. All done on hard mode. He is much better than me. Much more organised. <laughs> so it inspired me to uh, give this a try. Pack all our cargoes. We'll just do our crane. Didn't inspire me to load my trucks properly, but you know, one step at a time. So where we need to go with this, i show you, is down here into that house. So sort of the, the shortcuts aren't much of an option for us on this one unless, let's say we, we just take this one down and then come across and down. You can, so I've done it before sort of slide down here but would we do that on hard mode probably probably not same as you probably get through those rocks but because i miss things a lot of the time especially when it comes from this angle i am just gonna mark that point up so i know i want to go back and then mark that one up i'm gonna lose my voice finally get a chance to record and uh, run out of voice Get the damage either. Time is never an issue, it's the, the damage that tends to be the thing, especially at the minute with everything breaking all the time. But at least we'll have, felt, or at least I will have, feel like we've achieved something, just one little jobby. That'll do. Again, we could do this five times, we can do the other one five times, so. Yeah. I may end up doing that right near the end, just to see what sort of money we've got, whether it's going to be worth it, like with, with fuel costs and, and what have you. We'll see how we're looking financially uh, once we've done all our login and we've got everything else sorted. We may just do the simplest one, which is from the um, service point to the farm. Drop off stuff there. Is it the service point to the farm or service point to the drill? Somewhere there. That's sort of the easiest one. So that'll be the least pain, but it'll, it'll require less moving stuff around. If we want to start doing these runs like four more times after they've been done, that would probably entail moving the fuel back around, which uses fuel. We know how, how little I've got. <laughs> we are not going to have the best the best start when we do get to Alaska. I think really, really want to get to get a truck. 
I want to get my, my JDE load star. Ooh. Well, I thought we were going <laughs> to overly confidently thought we were going to romp through this. I've already picked out two trucks I'm going to try and go for in... Um, Right, didn't look right. Coming from a different angle at night. This is where you roll into the tree as well. You know it. Bloody branches. <laughs> Plenty of little roads like that we probably could just sort of try and slide down, but I just think at the minute it would be on to taking too many risks. I think mean, the risks have all been had. We ran out of luck probably on about episode six. <laughs> so I think this is going to be what, episode 40? I can't even remember how many how many episodes I said I'd be happy with us doing it. Uh, the, if we can keep it below 60, that's probably going to break it. <laughs> 20 more episodes to do, super order cement and all the logging and bring everything back and try and finish off whatever um, little uh, contest jobs there are. I feel like I like something. Oh, don't you, don't you, don't you, don't you. Well, at the minute, if there's a hole, we will find it. That's a big fuel tank, so like, got to be careful on how we even get this, get this back afterwards as well. The trouble you spend years playing that and, and think you're doing good on normal mode, but whenever you run out of fuel or anything, just hop it back to the garage. Oh, don't! Oh, 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 oh mate, mate. <laughs> Spider-Man reflexes, come on. Right. I lost where my track is now. Ah, that. Love that panic. Just gonna pass out. There it is. Over there. Whatever was that, eh? Trying to do us dirty like that.
not even sure what this one even pays out. Probably like three grand. Ooh, what's this? What's happening? Decide on whether to flip my truck or not. Are they not? <laughs> not even packed. There, oh dear. Right, probably got it in under the eight minutes anyway. A little time. Four grand. Four grand for that job. So, um, 99,000. Well, that'll buy me the one truck that I want. That'll get me a lot of going on. Now I'm 100% confident I have not left anything running today. 100%. So you go in. I thought, I thought we were sort of progressing through the uh, the boggy mud quite well because I had packed the cargo we did well not to lose it when we had the uh, the little tippy tie <laughs> so we need to get this to a quarry Apologies for the performance. What's going on? My CPU is getting a bit hard. I don't like that. I'll have a little look into that after the recording before starting the second one. doing is it's meant for the region so we want warehouse and that's it here two to the warehouse ah, if we go up to the warehouse we can come back down and um, <laughs> try to do that job again yeah makes sense Be surprised if we get all the bad luck and um, have some sort of accident in the quarry.
I've said it many times, probably about the fleets. That was my favourite little truck to come up and down in the quarry with. It is capable and it's nice and agile most of the time. Oh, we have to get it. It's not there, is it? It's uh, manual. Well, not manual, it's automatic, so it's going to cost us pennies. So load. Shall we? It's packed. Oh, it's because it went in automatically. Is it? In? Whoa! Oh, that camera. That makes you. Whoa. So, if I say, is that a vertigo thing? If that that movement makes me feel a bit nauseous, something nauseated. Yeah, it gives me the feeling of travel sickness. Like a forty-one-year-old man, I still get travel sick all the time. Anything more than about ten miles. But yeah, when that when that camera starts bobbing around, this out of my control. It makes me feel so nauseous. I'm not even being dramatic. so dramatic with it. Just flip your truck already. That's what we're here for. Flip your truck. Fuel, which is annoyingly out of the way. Can I move the fuel? Probably. I'll turn the truck around now, though. Oh. It's all these silly little maneuvers where I mess up. I'll tell you what, where's this? Where's the one for the. Uh, just head back to black. We don't go that way, we'll just do that. Oh, I don't want to. Oh, I'm going to put it on the trailer. I'm going to put it on the trailer, and that can go with the Super Order, even if that's like the, the last one that goes with Super Order. Drive all the way back out and back in again, that's silly. Because then I can fuel up. So I come past. Oh, you want that? Fuel up so I come back past. Fuel down, grab two more, and take them to the warehouse.
So there's only four things to go to Black River. So we're going to put them, insanely enough, we're going to put them on the twin stair, I think. There's only four slots on the twin stair, isn't it? So that we do have two more trailers, don't we? So, um, I keep forget where the job is. Island Lake goes to the lumber mill. Drummond Island goes to the logging station. Yeah. Tell you what, we might. I, yeah, I think I am. I think I am just going to load up. I don't want to do that. There we go. Recovery and preparation. That's what this will be called. Since we're not really completing the job, I have to think of a title for it. Recovery and Preparation. Although we did do the, uh, the sinking, was it sinking feeling or whatever it was called? This will probably be the first bit of real preparation of any sort. Any sort of any kind, any sign, so I can say, sort of kind that we've done since we were, you know, getting ready to do stuff in Black River. It, like, it all went out the window. I don't know why. Like, I, I never wanted to preempt deliveries and stuff like that. But I, I don't know why I didn't think a little bit more about what I was doing and where I was going with stuff. very frustrating to know that I didn't. Wasted so much time. And then in wasting time, I get a little bit panicky and I get a bit rushed. And then I make mistakes, forget things, but roll the truck. Poodling about at night.
it is a bit strange that you can't load onto the, uh, the loading platform with the cement. I don't want to grumble over it, but it just seems a bit strange. Getting a bit bouncy there. Careful of the angles and the, the camber of the land. It'll be something silly like that. It'll, we'll, we'll lose a wheel off a crappy little bridge and I'll be over again. It will come. <laughs> Go. Yeah, we probably should have parked these trailers all a bit closer. I just didn't want them up on the uneven ground. Near the quarry where I'm going to be turning and pulling out. Near the warehouse. Near where we've got fuel and repairs and stuff like that. I just didn't want it all bogged on itself. Standard. What's going on? What is? First. There we go. That behaved itself. I 
What do I keep doing that? Do we bring it in a little bit closer? Is a bit far away. Doing whatever. I think it's because I'm pressing B to disconnect because I'm using it like the winch. Now what we stepped up? Come on. What is going on? I crazy. It's not going to bode well, is it? Right. I expect that exact same mess up to happen on the next trailer as well. See if we can get back down the quarry at least. I think we've got now. An hour and a half. About five minutes. Go through my tree that I like to use for my marker. That's perfect. Turn back around. Where's the time? Let's just check. Oh, we've got more time. We good, we good. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry about that.
do in here with the gears. Come on. Perhaps our route is getting a little bit meh. We, we churned up there. We're not gripping where we were before, so we're not not getting the traction to turn. It's tight. Possibly, perhaps the last one will have to go out the other way, just to be safe. say to be safe, I find this doing, getting out of here this way much more stable than going round there's a bit over there somewhere, is it up there? I can't remember there's a bit where they, it just doesn't like <laughs> it just leans and we don't need any help tipping over at the moment he says I'll get that right either, did I? top on the tarmac and then we'll, uh, we'll check our time again. Call that it with a little 10 minutes spare. Very rarely we have any time left over, so we'll we'll take that. Hopefully, you've enjoyed that one. Um, you know, just getting ready to uh crack on with the big jobs. Hopefully, you've enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big fat thumbs up down below. If you're new, hit the subscribe button, turn on bell notification, and find out when new videos are going live. As always, comments and feedback down there. I'm going to try and get a few of these done throughout today and tomorrow. And I'll get them on the schedule as soon as I can. Uh, so again, apologies if there's been a bit of a wait for this one. It's just, 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 just tough getting the time to record them. I and mean, I'm going to pop and go check that the little people and the missus all right before I try and get the next one on. And I'm also going to see what's going on with my CPU. But that's it for today. So uh, have a good one, and uh, hopefully I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.